All right. Hey everyone. I hope you're doing well. Dozer here, checking in for another video. So today I've been hanging out, drinking some dragon's milk, great beer, and playing with some knives, and been actually reading the Discipline Equals Freedom Field Manual by Jocko Willing. Great book, right there. And I decided to make a video about a pretty incredible gun, and that is the Colt Python. And you can see right here, I've actually put together a little model for you guys, some of the inner workings of the gun, the action, as well as some broken down schematics and drawings of the gun. So we're going to get to that in a little bit, but for those of you who have been living on another planet, I'm going to start out here with some history of the Python and how it got so well known. So why don't you just sit back and enjoy and remember to give this video a little thumbs up and follow my account if you like what you see. Here we go. So I'm going to come right out and say it. The Colt Python is the best production revolver of all time. I said it. The Python was first introduced in 1955 as a double action revolver chambered in 357 Magnum and it is really easy to recognize one because of its famous high polish finish options, that ventilated rib, and Oh my god. So the trigger on this. If you're lucky enough to get your hands on one, it has an insanely, and I mean insanely smooth, trigger pull. Since its release, the Python's come out with a 6-inch barrel, 4-inch barrel, 2.5-inch barrel, a very rare 3-inch barrel version, and an 8-inch barreled Python in 1980 for hunting. Now, the Python has always been marketed as the best of the best, so it doesn't come cheap, and... Especially now that it's not produced anymore. One of the main reasons for its exceptional, and I mean exceptional, quality is that only the highest skilled workers were allowed to work on the gun. Some, some men would train for years at Colt producing lower level guns before they were allowed to even touch a python. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, some additional details. The python has a fully adjustable rear sight. Its cylinder locks up real well, so there's no play between the chamber and barrel at full cock. Um, it features some really well placed checkering around the gun in order to, to in, uh, can't talk today in order to improve the shooter's control. And again, that awesome, awesome trigger pull. The accuracy of the gun is great. Um, now, the beginning of the end for the Python started in 1997 when manufacturing of the gun switched from the assembly line over to the Colt Custom Shop, and then in 2005, the Colt Python officially went out of production. Um, let's see here, a little fun fact before we jump back to my model is that the Python has recently gotten even more popular because of its use on, um, on, um, ah, of course, of course I lost it now, on, there it is, The Walking Dead. It is featured heavily on that show. So let's jump back to my model here and talk about some of the inner workings of the gun. Alrighty, I hope you all enjoyed that little rundown. So now I'm going to give you a bit of a closer look at this model that I've made, which, as I'm sure you see, after looking at the actual gun, does not come close to doing it justice. What it does do, though, is show the main parts of the action in what I think, at least, is a pretty clear way. So, here we have the trigger, the hammer, the hand, the bolt, the main string, main spring, I'm sorry, third time today, I think, and the hammer stirrup, which connects the main spring to the hammer there. So, you know, I think that's about it, folks. I don't have much more to say. This is a fantastic gun. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and follow my page. Have a good one. Dozer out.